Hey everyone, it's Mike. Um, today, as you see, um, I had took this motor out of this um, Oldsmobile and Trig. Um, as you can see, today we are going to be um, replacing heads, the head gaskets on this motor. As you can see, I got the top bar torn out. Um, as you can see, the bolts that hold them is, is a star key. Um, it's a um, 10, it's a Pittsburgh brand, it's a 10 Allen key, um, that's that's the one you're going to need to get these bolts out. Um, as you can see, I got my cam ears off, um, as you see my chain and my tensioner, I took that off, because you know I have to move it out of the way when the head pull off, and um, I put the engine to dead top center. Um, you can look that up on um, like Google or anything. As you can see, is my um, two chain color links on that dot, and um, my little cam gear. Um, you can see this notch up in the air, um, like a one o'clock position. All I did is keep turning this and turning this. I know you're gonna have to turn a, a few times, like a lot of times, to get this in time. This one off. You know, I'm taking this off because I'm taking the head off. So. Um, what I'm gonna do is um I'm trying not to move this as possible. I'm trying to keep it, you know, the same. Like this up. <clears throat> Let me show y'all real quick. Make it easy for y'all. Um, as you can see, these in the back up. That one up. That one slanted. That's all you have to look at put it in um, time um and another thing i'm going to show y'all i'm gonna have to move this you know exhaust i was about to pull all two of the heads off at a time but i'm just moving move the back one and seeing if the head is really damaged before i go either farther um as you can see my magnifold bolts all out um i really ain't got that far to go um, as you can see my rest of my stuff over here my time gear bigger ear gear that's my bigger one. I'm gonna I'm gonna show y'all how to get that off. So y'all don't have to um tear the whole side off of the cover. What I did was I um, loosen this boat 15 millimeter to get this boat off. It was sitting down up in there. I loosened it off and I pry it out. I pry it out with um my my um I think um 12 inch crowbar. And I pry it out on the side and be very, very careful. And I pry it out to that fell out that clip. To that clip. Um, and the chain down there, I got a magnet to get that. So the only thing I'm gonna have to take a loose is them two bolts for that lever. See them? See this kind of worn out. That need to get replaced. But that's what I did. And as you can see, I got my um my oil cap cover. That also run by um an Allen key as well, and to sit up in here, just screw right in there. So it's really not that bad. And I have to remove this bracket off. I could get that one off. If I can get that bolt in there off, if I can pull this head out. And I see a little few more bolts down there holding the head on. And these Allen keys, you have to get them off too. So y'all guys, it's really not that hard if y'all want to do a timing chain that this whole cover and everything had to come off is really not that bad only thing i say get the, the timings in the right place in order you'll be straight um like i say again this one got a brown link darker color link too see that one that one dot that one gonna meet up let me see where they're at to this dot that's a dot on there and it's a dot on the on the left side so that's gonna meet up to there like I said, y'all could go on Google Time and Mark pages. And they'll show y'all how to um, line it up. It'll be a diagram picture. Um, other than that, um, that's it, y'all guys. Um, be sure to take all your bolts out. And your bolts, your little small bolts in the corner, take them out. And take these guys out. It's it called a time and chain, the guys, but keep it tight in there. Like I said, I'm loosening um, these oil caps, and you'll see a boat in there. It's not hard at all. You won't miss it. 
and then that's a loosen um that will loosen allow you to loosen the timing chain and make sure you put like a paint get some white out and paint coming across here like that put a dab of paint so you can know what what time is is the engine is so you won't mess up the timing so that's it um thank you you guys please subscribe and like thank y'all